Hi, I'm Jerry, and welcome to my channel, JCC is his name, and to this, let's see, what is it, number four, episode four in my 12 inch uh, Final Fantasy, The Spirits of Acts and Fingers, and this is number four, is Gray Edwards, and uh, I think, uh, I think you was one of the last figures I got uh, uh, when I was collecting the series. And anyhow, uh, these are really great figures, and so I, I quit talking, start showing. So here is Gray Edwards, Final Fantasy. Okay. And you notice that uh, there's Aki and Sid and Gray Edwards and General Hine. Okay. And it comes with a neat window box like that. So you open this door up later. Apparently, Palisades Toys. The uh, left side. Great entrance. So, uh, clips from the room, I presume. Okay. 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 And the other side is the same thing, I think. No, different, different, different pictures, okay? The other side is different pictures. Okay. Same wording though, okay? Because the bottom is, oh yes. Revealing, revealing, and this is, the top is very dusty. I had this one setting out because I don't have room for it in the box. Uh, there, there's the top of it. Okay. And the back of it. Okay, now this is, was, I think, a newer figure because it has the uh, phantom image here. When the first ones came out, they only had. Uh, Aki and San and Haim and uh, Gray Edwards, okay? So this is a newer version, I think, of Gray Edwards as well. So there's a, you see, that's a phantom that came out. And, and there's those figures. Now, I don't know if those are newer figures or just a rehash of the, uh, the old ones that are trying to advertise. There's a credits. Okay, there's a 2001. Okay, Palatine's Toys. Okay, well, Final Fantasy. And Great Anglers. And there, there's a, a little bit about him, a little bio. Really trying to in a leader of the elite. I guess that's uh, Drop Force uh, Squadron. Yeah, I hope you all have seen the movie. Uh, it was on Amazon. Uh, it'll be uh, uh, up until uh, March 31, 2021. 20, it's available on DVD. Uh, it's, I think it's well worth the price. Uh, Okay, now, on the inside. Okay, so, the inside is, it has a storyboard, about the whole story, and there's a figure. Now, I'm showing the story uh, in some other video, uh, where you can actually read it. So, I'm not going to do it this time. I will focus on taking this baby out. And I can put it there, you can pause it if you want to, and try to read the whole thing if you want to, but you help. And here's a figure as it was presented, let's see, there he is, like that, a figure of weapon, uh, I guess there's a knife there somewhere, uh, I see a space for it. I'll have to show how you find it. Uh, weapon and a helmet. 
Okay. Gray Edwards. 2001. Okay. Okay. So let me open this baby up. It wasn't really taped down, so I, uh, I was able to, uh, take this like this. Professor Edwards. Do I have his knife somewhere? Okay. for the knife so I don't know if he even had a knife in, in this in this uh, packing pack out okay because uh, I had no place to put put it uh, uh, no, 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 okay so let me get right with the figure here he is and uh, I need uh, something to Behind, uh, what do I have? Let me find something that I could uh, put behind. Okay, okay, this will make it easier. Oops. There he is, right, Edwards. The helmet here. Finger, soft goods, boots. Uh, uh, looks pretty, pretty detailed workmanship. Very well made. Right. Uh, uh, United States Marine Forces or military forces. Okay. Holster for knife on his arm or leg, but nothing, so I'm not too sure he even had one. Okay. Uh, so I need how articulation. Very flexible. Okay. Arm goes out pretty good. Has this little thing here that actually moves around. Uh, it ro rolls or rotates pretty good. Okay. I would say it's double jointed. Uh, double jointed. Wrist, hand, looks good, rotates around. Lots of articulation in this, okay. And uh, hands involved joint on this thing. I'm not quite sure. Let's see. Uh, okay. And you both are the same thing, of course. Yeah, have this really weird thing. I'm not quite sure what that is. So kind of flat to protect the arm, I guess. Anyhow. And, uh, <coughs> interesting thing here. With the, uh, <coughs> something to do with, uh, uh, 
I don't know, uh, some kind of flight maneuver. Um, uh, when you drop down, they, uh, they use that and you drop it down off a of drop ship. Okay. The legs. Like that. Let's see here. Uh, I got this right. Well, let me get articulation in your leg. Uh, foot. I see none in a foot or at all. Just a uh, knee and rotation in your thigh. Okay, so that's Mr. Gray Edwards, the uh, main man. Uh, great Scott King. It's, it's actually some degree of playability. Uh, okay. Here's a weapon. Main thing. Uh, let's see here. I'll go like this. A weapon. Okay. Looks pretty good. Okay. Okay. And uh, this part here, I think it goes up like that. Whoops. Took it off. Okay, there it is. It's quite interesting how it loads up like that. Okay. So all I need to, uh, you know, when you're, it should be probably right here. I have some of the best stuff I think goes. I think it goes there, actually, is what I think. Yeah, yeah, I think it goes there. I don't know what, what it is for. Uh, it could go over here too, see. It could go right here. Okay, like right. There's a couple of spots right here and right here that are holes. Okay. I don't know what this thing is for. Anyhow. Anyhow, that's uh that's a that's a blaster to use. Now the, the helmet. This is my favorite part. That is one cool looking helmet. Okay. Inside, if you fancy about it, Rich Scott King. Of course, the uh, eye things actually look inside, you actually see the eyes actually are have this light shining strong. Isn't that very cool? Very cool. So I didn't really went to a lot of detail on these, this figure, these figures. Let me see how it looks on here, okay. There it is, okay. That's very good. Okay, underneath there. That's very good. So, it's a good fit. Looks pretty good. Does the job. Provides the, uh, let's see where the eyes hit. Her eyes are right here. Let's see. Ah, close enough. Close enough. All right. Not bad. Okay, well, I see I was approaching 15 minutes on this video. So, hope you like this. Uh, this is, these are really cool figures. They have them, they still have these for sale on eBay. Uh, I'm not too sure how great prices are, but in case you're interested in quite some of them, there are some available. And, uh, uh, 
And uh, I think they're, you know, is the price reasonable? And I think they're worth having if you are to call his figures. And uh, you may hear no stand with this. They have no, no holes, nothing. So you have to, they stand. This is how long it stands. They stand pretty good by themselves. Wouldn't hurt to have a doll stand, though. Help us support him in case you want to pose it. And uh, for posing, I see this kind of this stuff here makes it impossible to have him posed down with his knee blasting away. Or, uh, he has, has to blast away from standing up. Let's, let's look at that. One more thing. See how he holds the weapon here. Okay. Let's see. Let's see how can I do it. Uh, okay. Why if it needs to be on a hard side, I got it. <laughs> okay. There's a weapon now. See if he can it has both has a grasp clasping, not one is for uh Yeah. Okay, that's about the best you can do. Okay. Yeah, what boss that bugger man Zap <laughs> Get that phantom. Right, <laughs> right. Okay. Okay. Hope you enjoyed that. These are pretty cool. I like these. And uh uh, stay tuned for next episode. We'll see you then.